physics you should study mirror formula. You remember? Mirror formula. Now we should point on lens formula. So I am just writing the first the mirror formula. So then we should compare it. It's very easy to study. Okay, that's the reason. First one is mirror formula. Anyone to remember that is the mirror formula? 1 by F equal to 1 by V plus 1 by U. That is mirror formula. Okay. What are the two different types of mirrors? Plain mirror and spherical mirrors. Spherical mirror are two types. Concave and convex. That is your ninth light chapter. Now we have to go on. That is reflection. Now it is going on refraction. Refraction is happening in lenses. Lenses is have two types of spherical lenses, concave and convex. You already know that. So that is the mirror formula. 1 by F equal to 1 by V plus 1 by U. What is small letter F? Capital F is focus. Focal length. Ah, small letter F is focal length. Focal length. What is the meaning of focal length? It's distance between optical center and focus. Focus. That is called as focal length. You already know that. Then what is V? V means image distance. V is called as image distance. What is U? Object distance. Very good. Object distance. Object distance that is called as U. I just draw the diagram and uh, spherize you one other. Is that yours? This is a chord. Which lens is? Convex. Very good. Convex lens. Optical center. This is? F1. 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 Very good. F1 and F2. F2. This O to F2, this distance is called as focal length. length. This is my object here though. This distance is U. This is my image. That means this distance is V. Clear everyone? Yes, image please. distance is V. Object distance is U. Uh, distance between O to F, that is focal length. Clear the doubts? Yes, yes. Okay. Then this is the mirror formula. Now we want to go on what? Lens formula. Lens formula. So what is the difference here? Second one is lens formula. 1 by f equal to f. Equation. Same. 1 by f equal to 1 by v. Difference is in the case of plus. The case of lens that one is coming? Minus. 1 by v minus 1 by u. That is the lens formula. The case of mirror formula 1 by V plus 1 by U. The case of length formula 1 by V minus 1 by U. Small letter F is the focal length. V is the image distance. U is the object, object distance. distance. All the measurements almost is measuring in the unit of centimeters. Clear everyone? Yes. yes. So, the 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 last topic, last theory part of the chapter, that is the power of lenses. What is the definition of power of lenses? The power of lens is defined as the ability to converge or diverge. Converging lens is? Convex. Convex is converging. Diverging lens is? Convex. So it is the ability to converge and diverge. A beam of light. What is the meaning of beam of light? Normally the light ray, light is represented by just like a rays. Ray. Okay. Ray means one is defined point, that one is infinity, that is the ray. The combination of rays that is called as B. Clear everyone? So combination of rays that is called as B. Rays are being a combination of ray that is called as B. Okay, that is the reason the beam of light falling on it. So that is the definition of power. That is the symbol for power. T is the symbol for power. P equal to inverse of F. F means focal length. So, inverse of focal length is called as power. So, that focal length in meter, that is a specified condition. So, inverse focal length in meter, that is called as power. Unit of power is diopter. Diopter is the unit of power. Symbol is D. So, here's a quote. So, maybe I can tell it as 5 diopter, 5 D in the case of convex lens. Otherwise, Minus 3D in the case of converse corner lens. What is the meaning of that? That is the power of that lens. Clear everyone? Okay, power means the ability to diverging and converging of a beam of light falling on it. That is called as power. P equal to 1 by F in meter. Meter, meter that is the 
multiply that and unit of the power is diopter. Clear everyone? So one of the topic is left for the review. Next, at a distance of 12 cm from a convex lens. So what is the given lens is? Convex. convex. How to draw the convex lens? Like that. No? Yes, convex lens, optical center, principal axis. So from this the question, the given data is convex lens. I just draw the convex lens. Okay. On its principal axis. The, uh, the object is placed at a distance of 12 cm from the convex lens. So all the measurements are starting from? Optical yes. center. We already know. Yes, so from the optical center, from the lens, the distance is 12 cm away. Who is that? Object. Clear everyone? Listen here. So from the lens, 12 cm distance, the object is here. Can I here the Yes, ma'am. Okay, 12 cm, the object is here. And the image is formed on the other side of the lens. So this is the object. So where is your image? Other, other side, side of the lens. At the distance of 80 cm from the lens. So this distance is also starting from? Optical center. center. Other side of the lens, that means in this side, distance is 18 cm. This is your image. I am just going here, this is not compulsory. Okay? This is the image. Image. Find the focal length of the lens. What is your question? Find focal length. What is the symbol of focal length? F. Small f. Letter f. So this is your question. Focal length. And if the image is magnified, justify your answer. So we want to find out focal length. First we should using the length formula. What is length formula? 1 by 1 by f is equal to. Anyone please tell the answer. It's 1 by v minus 1 by v. 1 by f equal to 0. 1 by f equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u. F is your question. What is a v? 12 cm. Is already given. What is you? Object That is also given. Listen here. This is step number 1. We should write the length formula. Step number 2. Apply the sign Cartesian conversion. Listen here. I am just writing that F is my question. V is given. V is image distance. So, V equal to. This is the image distance V. I am right. So, this is incident ray. So, V direction is similar to the incident ray direction. Am I right? Yes. Am I right? Yes. So, the V is same direction of the incident ray. That's the reason sign is positive. Okay. So, V equal to positive 18 centimeter. Samaj kya sakho? Yes. Then, what is U? U means object distance. How to take the object distance? From the optical center, this is the object distance. This direction is opposite to the direction of incident ray. That's the reason sign is negative. So u equal to negative 12 centimeter. This much clear over? Yes, ma'am. Yes. Apply the data here. 1 by f equal to 1 by 18 minus already here, am right? 1 minus is already here. Then after that, 1 by minus, minus 12. Of 12. This minus of minus come to? Plus. plus. So 1 by F equal to 1 by 18 plus 12. 1 by 12. What is the LCM of 18 and 12? So 1 by F equal to 18 and 12 LCM. 26. 26. 
So first you should write the length formula. Second you should check out the sign conversion, sign of the U, V and F. Then after that, apply it. LCA method, simplify the mathematical way. You should get the answer. Clear everyone? Yes, ma'am. Yes. In a doubt you have, which lens is this? Convex lens. I draw a convex lens. Optical center, principal axis. Which lens focus is this? Primary. F1, F2. Convex and up. So the object distance is given from the lens 12 cm, right? Yes. From the lens 12 cm. So measurement is starting from optical center to 12 cm. It is your object. Okay? Then image is other side of the lens. That means this side from the optical center 18 cm. That is the distance of your image. This is my image. I for image. This is the given data. First means find out focal length. This is very small letter. This is your question. Find focal length. Step number one. Write the lens formula. So I am just writing the lens formula. What is the lens formula? 1 by f equal to 1 by v minus 1 by u. This is much clear? Yes. Sir. Step number 2, sir, don't write down. Step number 2, apply the Cartesian sign conversion. Cartesian sign conversion means this is the incident rate. Am I right? Yes, sir. Incident rate. So object distance is starting from optical center to this direction. So this direction is opposite to the incident ray. So sign is negative. That means u equal to u means object distance. Object distance equal to minus 12 centimeter. Samaj gaya ma'am? Suppose samaj gaya kaise minus aagya? The next one is image distance. That is v. V is starting from optical center to this distance. That is 18. That is the same direction of incident ray. So sign is positive. Positive 18 centimeter. Clear map? Clear everyone? So U negative, V positive. F we want to find out. Apply the given data in the equation. 1 by F equal to 1 by V minus 1 by U. So 1 by F equal to V value is plus 18 minus 1 by minus 12. So you get to see here minus of minus plus the mathematical expression minus of minus is plus. So 1 by f equal to 1 by 18 plus 1 by 12. Clear? Then take the LCA method, otherwise cross multiplication also. LCA method is easy one. So 18, 12 to LCM is 36. You know how to find out LCM? Yes. Huh. That, that you just ask your max teacher. Okay. So very easy, fifth standard max. 1 by F equal to 18, 12, LCM is 36. How many times the ATM is in 36? 2. In 12, made? 3. So you should get the answer is 5 by 36 centimeter. Okay? So 1 by F equal to 5 by 36. So F equal to 36 divided by 5. Divide this one, you should get the answer 7.2 centimeter. This is the focal length of this cord. Convex lens. Listen here, I want to say one more point also. This is the secondary focus, am I right? Yes. Direction is starting from optical center. So this direction is positive and negative. Positive, positive. positive right? Yes, so answer will go positive. Clear everyone? Yes. So always keep it in your mind. Convex lens focus is positive. Concave lens focus is negative. negative. Clear everyone? I repeat one more. Convex lens focus is positive. Concave lens focus is negative. 